Hello and welcome everyone, this is Invisible with you again playing Sphinx and the Crisis Mummy. In the last part we have got stuck in some very annoying puzzle uh, that's about the colors. In this part we have discovered how to um, finish the puzzle so we can continue on. Don't worry, I will show you right now how to solve it. So right now, shall we begin? Let's continue. Okay. Now. Okay. Continue on. So right now. So. So. Okay. Shall we continue this quest over here? Look right now. We have uh, three silly pillars over here. Okay. If you are smart enough or close eyes enough, you will notice that this one is the fastest. This one is the slowest, and this one is half half. So right now, what you will have to do is. Grab this one for the end of it. Once you have it, okay, fa as fast as you can. Go to the third one and get it faster, faster, faster. Release it. Get to the second one. Grab it. Sphinx, come on, please. Faster, faster. Jump. Do not delay. Jump. Jump again. Jump plus time and jump over here. Break the line that's going to be here and ta da! There you go, the line that I told you. Yes, it is an, a blue circle. Anyway, come over here to get to the place, right here, and use the lever for some reason. <coughs> well, well, how nice. Okay, now, this will mean I will have to right now go over here again, backtrack myself, <coughs> and get out of from here to this place over here. We're going to go back to the place where we found earlier uh, Bob. Over here, right here, we'll jump over this one over here and we'll hopefully live to tell the tale about this place. Inside this place right now, we have here a Bob. Get him. We'll need some more of it. So just make sure you have one of your beetles that is ready to work. Um, Bob, come on, come out. Bob. Okay, good. You have just wasted on me a beetle. Silly Bob. Okay, now. How many Bobs we have right now? I mean, the capture beetles. Okay, very good. Excellent work. They don't want to tell me. Anyway, get a another one of these and catch it while it's still in its shelter. Another one of these and let make it to go inside to catch for you the fifth. Another one yet. That was way to stay that way. Another one yet, right now here, to catch it from its place. Shelter. Again, another one over here, just to get raised. And again, one over here, seventh one of the bobs. Again, um, s somehow it was wasted away. Again, got a bob. Again, throw it into his shelter. I let it until it spawns to get to nine. And the tenth, the last one of the bobs, will we will have to. Okay, now we have wasted too many of these capture beetles. Anyway, jump over here, jump again over here as fast as you can, jump again over here, and continue on your wor walking over here. You have right now the ability to unlock the last door since we have already its code. So, shall we go to the standard darts and fire one here, 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 and the last one will be here. Bingo. <coughs> right now, why the hell did they ask us to get so many bobs? We'll start now. Jump over here and enter this place. What the hell is this place? We have an enemy over here already. Kill it. Right for the win. Jump over here and kill it again. Again, again, again. No mercy at all. Show it. Um, again, another so much annoying sword man. Just kill him instantly. No mercy. Show it to it at all. Okay, and it's right now dead. Um, come over here and break this interesting thing, looking thingy, to get some more capture beetles, which is really great. Um, we will see right now over here some nice looking statue of an eagle. We'll come over here and looks, have a look over here. Hmm, very interesting. Get back and use a bob over here right now, like just like this, and wait for the results, what will be. Very good, thank you for the bridge. Jump over here, again here, and get ready to 
interrupt this third man from casting his very annoying uh, <coughs> skull thingy and kill him and get ready for the brother of this annoying sword man to come kill him right for the win do not show them any mercy at all because they are from Seth's um, apparitions kill him again and let me see over here so okay continue on the way over here again another bob use another bob over here to blast to you another bridge and let's wait a little bit jump over here over this place jump again for the win and break this thing up to get some more scarabs and then come over here use another yet no wow oh no why and he just still silent good not this i want a bob not an armadillo not a blaze i want a bob anyway jump over here jump over here make sure you know what you are the hell you are summoning not like me <coughs> and kill another sword man over here come come on come on come on come on come on slam him up shut up and die already will yeah please thank you so much and from this freaking life we will get a health and we'll get a liver for us to use which is going to unlock for us the last one so right now what the hell will be with the last could will be for us use a bob right now here again and the blast the ouch please jump it over again over here and jump it again what's this thing okay use again another bob over here and make him to blast for you the <coughs> wall uh what the are you freaking kidding me okay um Okay, is another yet? Okay, now. Uh, okay, is another bob over here, and let's try it out again. Bingo. So this is the solution. Not to get hurt, but this is the solution. It's a cross. Okay, get some more, even capture beetles, and get going on <coughs> outside this place. Now, the last one over is going to be here. We're going to use it across. One here, one here, one here, and one here. And we've got the glyph key. How nice. We're recording for... 10 minutes I do suppose, maybe. The left key. And we can now press this on. Since you saw already my face in my anniversary, I don't really have again to hide it. From the camera. Anyway. So, we have finished the, again, at last this freaking puzzle. This looks bad, very bad. Lord said the Gib are eternally grateful to you for bringing the sacred crown of Yurik. The crown will be totally secured in our hands. This is Sit, the guy with the white eyes. I am sure that you speak the truth. If not, the consequences for you will be terrible indeed. Do not worry, Lord, my lord said. Nobody has ever been able to overcome the power of Gib Queen. I should tell you that in the ancient Egypt, Gib was the name of the god of the earth. Interesting, isn't it? Ah, you have returned. Congratulations, Sphinx. I knew that you would prevail. Few people are able to survive the test of the temple. The artifact you have retried, retrieved can be used to active this Ka and firing point. I'm sure the adventurer of your experience is well aware of the mysterious machines of the Ka and 
Before you go, a word of advice. The Gibby Queen is a fearsome adversary. I, da I doubt that you will be able to defeat her all by yourself. In the head of the battle, you should not forget that other creatures may provide with you with a a personally you are required to defeat. Farewell, strength and good luck. He just gave us a freaking good piece of information. Anyway, use the glove key right here. And w before we go ahead and get the Gib Queen, we're going to save the game over here. So right now, you know the drill. Like and if you enjoy, subscribe for more videos in the future. Please comment and need to see you in the next video of this game. The Queen... <laughs> the video question for this uh, video will be um, how many Egyptian gods do you know about and who is your favorite one? If I already asked th this question before, then I want, uh, um, you know, <coughs> a re-answer for it. So right now, Invisible with you, looking out. See you all guys later and good luck.